introduce this uh, series. We, this is a read aloud series uh, sponsored by Ward Center. I am with uh, Friends of the Library of Hawaii, and we have a bookstore down the mall called Village Books of Music, and it's a fundraiser for Hawaii's 51 public libraries. Uh, there are actually three bookstores here at Ward Center. Uh, to my left, to your right, is Nameo Hawaii, and they sell a lot of local uh, and Hawaiian-focused books. Uh, to my right and your left, there's Logos Bookstore, and they sell Christian books. Uh, so there's a lot of uh, literacy here at Ward, and uh, if you joined us here yesterday, thanks uh, for coming back. And if this is your first time, welcome. We hope to have uh, these events more uh, than this one time. It was uh, looking pretty successful, and we're happy to see you here. Uh, there are um, donated refreshments after from Coffee, Vino, and Tea Leaf, and then later in the day, we'll also have refreshments from Sugar Vino two shops that are both here at Ward. Um, our first reader today is Kimberly Ratliff, and uh, she is not only the author of her book, but she's also the illustrator. And so she's an artist as well as an author. And um, again, come on up close uh, so that you can see her wonderful illustrations. And I will hand it over to Kim to Introduce her book and get started. Aloha, everyone. Can everyone hear me? Yeah? So you have cards back there, but I think we're good. I think this is ideal. So, like he was saying, yes, I, I wrote and I illustrated this book. I am an artist. Um, on all the books that I brought has my website on here and I have signed all the books that I've brought with, well, this one's my personal one, but the ones up there all have signature on it. Um, and this was my, my COVID baby. <laughs> my COVID baby me too, COVID baby. Okay, so I'm gonna just read, and then after we can, you guys can ask me questions or whatever. I'm thinking parents might have questions on it. So this is the book I read, I wrote. It's called Soul Finds Her Talent. And this is Soul. And in this picture, she's got all kinds of things. Magic, a ball, a baton, a violin. What is her talent? Hmm? So we got a flyer in the mail today about a talent show next Saturday in Heidi's backyard. So I'll ask Amma, what is a talent show? So Amma means mom in Korean. Amma explained, a talent show is where you can show everyone your talent or skill. A talent can be something you are good at and enjoy doing. It could be anything like singing, dancing, or magic tricks. So thought about things she might be good at. So her dog is good at balancing a ball. Her mom is good at singing. Her dad is good with the ukulele. And her aunt, her harmony, her grandmother is good with sewing. So visits her friend Heidi to get some ideas. Ooh, cupcakes. Heidi said, I'm showing everyone how I can decorate cupcakes for the talent show. Sol asked Heidi if she could decorate one too. Sol was not happy. I don't think I'm good at decorating cupcakes as you are. Good luck and thanks for the cupcake. And then Sol visits her goes Sol visits Penny to see what she's doing for her show. So she tried to decorate cupcakes, and here she is with this big mess. She's not as good. Hi, Penny, what are you doing? Penny said, I'm practicing my cartwheels for the talent show. So last, can you show me how to do a cartwheel? Sure, just copy what I do. Soul tried her hardest to do a cartwheel. 
She just could not get it right. So here's her friend going, and then Soul ends up on the ground. Saul was disappointed. I don't feel like I'm good at anything. Penny tried to cheer her up. I'm sure you'll find something you're good at. Hi, Zoe. Zoe replied, I'm practicing my whistling for the talent show. Saul asked, can you show me how to whistle too? Zoe said, sure, I'll try. Saul tried so hard to whistle. Finally, Zoe said, Soul, I think you need to let your teeth, wait, Soul, I think you, sorry. I only need glasses to read far away. She says, uh, Soul, I think you need to let your tooth grow in. You'll be able to practice every day once it grows in. Because she's actually missing a tooth. Soul said, I think you're right. Thanks for trying to teach me, Zoe. This made Soul very sad, and she went straight home. She was so upset about not being good at anything her friends were good at, she did not notice Harmony, her grandmother, peeking in her room. So there's her grandmother peeking in her room, and there's Soul and her little dog. Her little dog's name, Kinchi. And when he said, oh, my little doggy, that means loved one. You may not be good at the things your friends are good at, but you have your own unique talent dancing the Arirang Korean folk dance. You dance so beautifully. Seoul had not thought of her Korean dance school. This made Seoul happy, and she was now looking forward to the talent show. And here's a picture of the tent in her friend's backyard. It says, Neighborhood Talent Show. Everyone enjoyed Heidi's beautiful cupcake decorating skills. And then everyone enjoyed Zoe's whistling. Everyone enjoyed Penny's perfect cartwheel performance. And Soul danced from her heart. Everyone enjoyed her Arirang performance. She also had lots of compliments on her colorful hanbok, which is a Korean dress. See how colorful her dress is. Soul said to Oma, that was so much fun dancing for everyone. I liked watching my friends do the things they're good at too. We're all good at different things, even kimchi. Even kimchi. And then for parents, all the Korean words and definitions are in the back. Not too many, but good to know. All done. Is anybody proud of something that they like doing? Does anybody dance here? I think maybe parents might have more questions than babies. Yeah. So I'll just tell a little bit about myself. I am an artist. I have some graphic design background. And during COVID, I just thought, I've always had this children's book in my brain, but not connecting the dots or the right story. And then my niece was born just before COVID, and her name is Seoul, spelled like Seoul Korea. And we have a pug, and it's like a mashup of some people I know. And it's not entirely what Seoul's family is, but it's, a, it's, it's an arrangement that a lot of people can relate to and it's sprinkled with some Korean culture in there, and uh, yeah, 
and then I, I totally illustrated it digitally and had it, so I self-published it. And here we are. And I think everyone enjoyed it, yes? Thank you. I'm sure you have a talent. How about eating awesome snacks? That's probably a good talent. Would every, is everybody okay if I take a picture with the kids in front of us? Is that okay? I mean, your parents can come out too. I just think it would be a waste to not do something in front of this full display. Yeah?